right, what's up YouTube? So we're back at it again with another GS550 video. Uh, what we're going to be doing today is try to get these forks off, the wheels off, and hopefully the engine out. That way we can get this frame prepped for paint um, and then start the tear down process of the engine. That way we can rebuild the engine. Also, I want to knock these off the top or get a uh, top tree. Also, what we're going to do is we're going to map out everything that's going to go back on the bike. I'm going to do a little, probably mock-up of the, the build on a piece of paper and draw it out and probably do some paint uh, paint themes on it. So, let's get to it. is a universal tank. Um, I do have some issues with it though because it 
the way the frame is on this GS550, if the spine comes down and the spine stops here, and you got these two fork sides that go off the rest of the frame, um, they kind of hit the bottom of the tank here, which I've already did a little bit of modifications onto it. That way, it somewhat fit on here. Still got a lot of more work to do on it to get it to sit properly. But this is a lot smaller tank than the other one. It's a this one is a 2.4 gallon, a 2.5 somewhere in there. The other one's three and a half gallon, so it's a lot bigger. I mean, it was the original tank, I believe. Um, so we're gonna work on that uh, probably another day, not today. Try to finish that up, and uh, hopefully we can get the frame where we can get it to start grinding some of these little mount parts off. That way, it's not cutting my hand up anymore. I Hopefully, I'm still good on my tetanus shot because it is kind of rusted. And uh, I'm going to pull the front forks off. And that's what the plan is for now. Let's get to it.
tension out of the bike frame. I kept getting stuck on this cap. It goes right here. I don't know why I was just getting stuck on there, so I just took it off. It helped out a lot in getting the frame off. I was struggling at first until I realized that inside part of the frame, it uh, it's not a whole round bar. On the bottom side, it actually turns into a triangle going into the into the bar itself. So I kept getting in that groove and getting stuck. Um, I'm gonna keep the engine on this this tire for right now. I want a block of wood on top of the tire. That way I can try to work on it right here. Try to flip it over in just a second here. That way I can scoot it over to the side and work on it. Um, we're going to get back to the engine in the next video. Like usual, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment. There'll be a lot more videos. The 550, and like I said, we'll get back to the truck here soon. Um, hopefully I can get those other two videos to upload that have already recorded. Um, been having some issues with the program right now. So, looking forward to putting those up too. Alright, y'all take it easy. Be back here next time.